ha, 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 ha. It's looking like these rappers is trying to leave 2018 with a bang. What a year. Oh my God. The year in review that I'm going to do, or the review of the year that I'm going to do, think of how lit 2018 was, music wise. Oh my God. Takashi over there with, with, with the Gambino family. Eminem dropped two of them things. MGK got buried. The body soundtrack still ain't dropped. What is going on? Drake and Pusha T, Kanye and Drake. Kanye and Pusha T, y'all didn't even peep that one. Go watch that Joe Budden podcast. Y'all don't even peep that one. I peeped it. I peeped it real smooth. I peeped it real smooth. But what's going on? Huh? First of all, let me start this off by saying shout out to everybody who's been watching the chit chat video. I ain't with the chit chat to the back and forth. But if niggas want to nip, yeah, I'd be happy. Now I'm going to put the link to that at the end of this video. It's up to 5,000 views. The goal is 20,000. Because mm -hmm. we can get 20,000 on the first video off of Strictly for the Fans. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Today we're going live at 8 p.m. Eastern. I'm telling you right now, this is going to be my last live in Houston. In Houston. In Houston. This is going to be my last live in Houston. <laughs> but this is going to be the latest live. We are breaking down the official breakdown of Pusha T versus Tory Lanez and maybe Trippy. A lot of people are going to be doing reactions. A lot of people are going to be doing breakdowns, but not like me, man. Niggas don't watch battle rap, man. What is they even talking about, son? I watch some of these reviews. What are y'all talking about, man? Y'all don't know nothing about schemes. I don't know nothing about letter forms. Y'all don't know nothing. What y'all even talking about, bro? How at me when you watch some smack, you know what I mean? Go watch some KOT. No, not KOT. Go watch some RBE, man. Come back. The official. Oh, we breaking it down tonight. Shout out to all the donos in advance. It's going down. So, that's not even what we got to talk about today. Today. Pusha T and Drake started this year off. Was it start? Uh, it wasn't really start off the mid year. With a good, good, good battle. Good battle. And I mean a battle. That Pusha T came out the victor. It's not really an argument. Pusha T came out the victor. And I think 2018, I can't remember what year um, the Meek and Drake beef was, but it seems like every time Drake beefs with somebody, eat, win or lose, he leaves with, with, with mortal injuries. Not mortal because maybe he won't kill his career, but he leaves with big gashes. Yeah, he destroyed Meek. Yeah, he made it not cool to listen to Meek. Yeah, he made it impossible for Meek to get a W for a whole year and some change. But Meek and Drake are friends now. A lot of people, now that hurt Meek's career, but I think Meek hurt Drake's legacy with that Quentin Miller stuff. And then after, and I think that's why for so long they weren't friends and Drake was like, bro, like, there's certain things that I could tell offend Drake to a point where he wants to do something about it. And the ghostwriting thing is one of them. Because I know he was trying to... Uh, uh, Drake is a very legacy act. He, he, you, you hear him. Let's see if they hear 10 years. You hear him talk about it at, all, all the time. All the, all the time. You hear him talk about it. So, what I'm thinking is... Alright. Cool, he left that. Then, then he beefed with Pusha. And what came out of that? The baby... The Adidas deal was broke. All of this stuff. Then it goes on LeBron. Now, push the T. I'm going to put the... Uh, either the beginning of this video is going to be the fight or the end. I'm probably going to put it at the end. I'm going to put the whole video at the end. So, you know what I mean? Stick around for that. So, push the T. Goes to Canada, Toronto. And boy, were them dudes from the 6666. Wow, they got to, they said, they said, what, as soon as they saw Pusha T get on stage, they're like, hold on, what is this a boot? What is this a boot? Isn't this the guy that dissed Drake? Oh, man. About to show him what we boot right now. 
got to throwing the burr at him. And when I saw it, I was like, hold on, do they have like a fire hydrant of beer somewhere? Is there a Bud Budheiser, a, a, a fire hydrant somewhere? Cause boy, that boy push a guy hit with a tsunami of booze. He, I was like, now I've seen people throw beers before, but my G, it looked like it was, it's raining beer. Hallelujah, it's raining beer all over him. So Push was smart, because Push was like, oh, 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 watch them, watch them. For all those who watch Battle Rap, shout out to Ava. Hey, yo, watch them, watch them, watch them, watch them. Or, or shout out to Arson. Watch them, watch them, watch them. Pusha got out of there. I'm not mad at Pusha for getting out of there, because first of all, y'all think them dudes from the, come on, y'all think them dudes from the, from the T dot, hey, some, come on, man. There's some real, you know what I mean? Y'all see men some froze, man. More fire for your head top. Then I thought it was over. I was like, okay, that's crazy. Push his entourage comes out. Then I see homie get on stage. See, I didn't know who's on whose side at that point. I didn't know who was on whose side. I didn't know who was Drake. I mean, Drake's people. And who was Push's people? Who was the... So they got in there whopping. Bang, 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 bang. They're getting in there. Someone getting stomped. Someone getting the A-Town stomped. Bang, 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 bang. Now snap your fingers. Someone was getting A-Town stomped in there. Right? Pusha comes out a little bit later, and I know what Pusha was thinking. Pusha was like, bro, if we cancel this show now, it's going to look like Drake canceled our show, even if he didn't. Pusha gets on stage and insinuates Drake hired these people to throw beer at him. Now, here's what I'm going to say. I watch a lot of videos of people, oh, man, it can't be Drake who did that. Why would Drake do that? That doesn't even make sense. Listen, Drake is a lot more petty than we give him credit for. A lot. I think Drake seeing Pusha had a show in Toronto was like, okay, something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. But here's what I'm saying. All jokes aside, in my heart of hearts, I don't think Drake sent anybody. And 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 I'm not even trying to say Drake is a mafioso Gambino. Gonna make a mafia You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that, but I'm saying. Well, the reason why I'm saying I don't think Drake did this is because as crazy as this sounds, if Drake were to pay somebody to do something to push in Toronto, I don't think it would be throwing beer. I don't think it would be throwing beer. I don't think Drake's going to waste his, what currency did he use in Canada? Euro? No, that's, I was about to say something stupid. I almost said euros. Um, they didn't put in the comment section, what currency did he use in Canada? I don't even know. I don't think that's how it would have went down. Come on, Push. I don't think so. I think more would have happened to you. Um, now, there was a fight. I mean, I, there was a clear fight, clear as day. So I was just like, I don't put it beyond Drake, though. Push, it came out there the first thing. He said, y'all hire people. To... <sighs> now, Drake's obviously going to respond to this. So what I'm saying, Push, is I don't know if that was the smartest thing to come out and just blame Drake right away. Because I'm pretty sure now, even if it wasn't Drake, Drake can get credit for this. He probably, I mean, even if he don't take credit for this, he can get credit for it now. Like, yo, you ain't gonna come to Toronto and just have a hunky-dory time, like, G. Not a hunky-dory show. But it was a sold-out show. It was a sold-out show. So, I think Drake is like the mayor of Toronto. So, I'm pretty sure you would have got, got backstage or something. You would not have made it to the stage. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I feel Pusha, though. Pusha had to come out and, and save face. So put it in the comment section below. Do you think Drake sent those 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 goons to send fire in man's head top? Huh? Do you think Drake was trying to show Pusha what the T-Dot was a boot? Put in the comment section below. Now, keep watching that tick, uh, chit chat video. I'm gonna say TikTok. Chit chat video, we gotta get to 20,000 views. Once it hits 15,000, I'm gonna announce the next video. Just keep watching it. Thank y'all. Comment below. Today, 8 p.m. Eastern, going to be the livest. Oh, my God. If you are not tuned in to the Screw Reaction page at 8 p.m. Eastern, bro, listen, you're doing yourself a misfavor. I'm going to tell you right now, a grip. I ain't going to get a percentage. A grip of the dudes who talk about this are not going to be able to talk about it like me. If you don't believe me, just tune in. Tune in. Shout out to all the donos. I love y'all from the bottom of my heart. It's going down. Blah! <laughs>
Yo, screw is whack. As a matter of fact, he gonna make me grab the strap, meet him in the back, something like that. I don't even care. We up here, smoking it loud. It's in the air. Hey, yeah. Yo, bro, we gotta wrap this up. My fault. I got a lot going on and shit. I gotta make a couple moves. Really? Yeah, yeah, my fault. All right, my nigga. All right. Yeah. Something like that. Strictly for the fans. Strictly for the fans. Strictly for the fans. Yeah. I told him I'll keep it a buck on this one, I mean. That's what I'm gonna do. Listen. The hit brain I ain't with the chit chat just back and forth. Some niggas wanna nip that, let me have a dog. Give her what you wish for, what you asking for. Listen, love. I ain't with the chit chat to the back and forth. Some niggas wanna nip that, let me have a dog. Give her what you wish for, what you ask for. Oh, man. But now I got a big map, but I'm happy, dog. I ain't with the chick hey, out to the back and forth. Every time they get one and nip that, I be happy, dog. I'm talking to you. Give her what you wish for, what you ask for. Oh, man. And now I got a big man, my nigga, it's on me Yeah, it's on me No time to be gone, D, when the goal is in arm's reach They thinking it's all sweet Not seeing my palms bleed from turning the blade around Before they used it on me Cause the game is full of backstabbers, bad actors, mad rappers, mad dad The fact that the next act then surpassed And can't ask for another man's blessings Lest you live this confessions and transgressions Even then you'll never get it Not to mention all these foul niggas wouldn't know my shoes Even if you walk the mile of them so they can't judge me like a jury, yo, we'll go to trial with them Now there's open cases everywhere, but ain't no foul them Guess I'm just mad at the fucking world, I'm a wild nigga I ain't with the chit-chat to the back and forth If niggas wanna nip that, I be happy, dog Be careful what you wish for, what you ask for oh, man. But now I got a big map, but I'm happy, dog I ain't with the chit-chat to the back and forth Niggas wanna nip that, I be happy, dog Be careful what you wish for, what you ask for Feel my pain, nigga, now I got Listen. a big man But I'm happy, dog I ain't feeling excellent, always be second-guessing shit Paranoia setting in, when these niggas gon' let me in Cause I ain't fucking lying, I'm tired of being a pedestrian Prayed like a Methodist, trying to find what his method is I swear to God, I'm trying to find Jesus but I never did Now it's fuck all you non-believers This is exodus Cause some of y'all ain't believe in the God Now you faking shit You put me around so many frauds Now I'm the year So fuck who nice is Fuck your life and fuck your advice Shit I ain't fucking like it Needed a teacher Not future prices But them fake Let them say what them say But if them play Then man slay the sun see. I ain't with the chit chat To the back and forth if niggas wanna nip that I be happy dog Give her what you wish for, what you ask for oh, man. But now I got a big man, but I'm happy, dog. I ain't with the chit-chat to the back and forth if Niggas wanna nip that, I be happy, dog. Be careful what you wish for, what you ask for oh, man. But now I got a big man, but I'm happy, dog. Hey.